I'm actually slouching down so she doesn't have to hold her arm <laughs> to try to get it. You want to see how tall I really am? <laughs> it's not that bad. Did you just watch our United Basic Economy video or United Airlines review video? In that case, welcome back! Today we are going to compare economy and economy plus classes, ultimately sharing if the extra cost is worth it. We've flown with United to places like North Carolina, Jamaica, Panama, Texas, California, Nevada, Washington, Louisiana, Buffalo, New York, Kentucky, and many more. Previously, you may remember we explained the similarities between basic economy and economy seating. We want you to remember that besides amenity, the literal seat and your, and your experience is pretty much the same as your economy passenger. Well, this does not apply to Economy Plus. On most flights, these seats are in a section between First Class and Economy, and its biggest feature providing more legroom on most airplane models. Seats in United's Economy Class have a width of 17.3 inches and 31 inches of legroom or seat pitch. Although Economy Plus seating has the same seat width, it's got a total of 37 inches of legroom, which is a whole extra 6 inches of legroom. On one of our most recent flights, we had a tight squeeze in our row, but a nice space between our knees and the seats in front of us. This is one of the main reasons we upgraded. Kamau is 6 foot 2 and appreciates all the space he can get. The other perk of selecting Economy Plus are available outlets. Some United aircraft sometimes have outlets in Economy as well. Most often it is available only in Economy Plus and First Class. Just remember, it's not a personal one. You will have to share. Oh wait, if you're new here, I'm Selena and this is my husband Kamau. And this is The City and Beyond, where we encourage and equip full-time employees to be the best part-time travelers they can be. If you like what you see, hit subscribe. So those are the main perks of Economy Plus. In our opinion, these aren't enough for us to upgrade every single United flight we take. Although Kamal does appreciate the legroom. The times that it's most useful are the transcontinental and international flights because of how long they are. But basic economy tickets purchased with our United Explorer card still seem like a better bargain. Not only do you still get to bring a carry-on bag along with your personal item, but you also board the plane in group 2. And you still have that possibility of still sharing that outlet, depending on the aircraft. Let's talk about how we get the perks that we do with our United Explorer card. Carry-ons and check bags are free. However, they are only free when you book your ticket with the United Explorer card. You can't do it after the fact, you have to do it while you are booking. Did you decide to pay for the Economy Plus upgrade? Share your opinion in the comments below. And if you found this information valuable, give this video a big ol' like. And while you're at it, subscribe! So we can see you next week. Bye! If you like airline reviews, Keep a lookout for our JetBlue one coming out in a few weeks.